There are two diphthongs um, that are a little bit unusual. We have I and ow, and they're different because the on glide is a little bit different. It's a vowel that doesn't occur on its own in English, except in some dialects. So let's explore this a little bit. Um, if we say I, um, we start at a, a, I, and it's not a like hat, and it's not a like hot. It's this other vowel, um, and it's written as a lowercase a, the same lowercase a you find on a keyboard. Um, and it's different than the script a that we use in a word like hot. So what is this vowel? So it's a vowel that occurs in some dialects of English. So um, if you think of somebody saying, oh my god, Tom, Tom, oh my god. Well, they're not saying gad. They're not using a like hat. They're not saying, oh my god, Tam. They're saying, oh my god, Tam. It's in between a and a. They're also not saying, oh my god, Tom. It's this thing in between. It's this lowercase a. And so some dialects use that, uh, it, like I just um, imitated. Um, it could also occur in something like hardly. Oh, I hardly know. I hardly know what to do. Hardly. Um, that is an example of that vowel. Um, also, if someone were to say, you want to play cads? Who wants to play cads? Again, they're not saying cads. They're not saying cods. They're saying cads. Who wants to play cads? Um, that's the vowel. And I use that vowel only for diphthongs. So I use it when I say I and ow but I don't use it in my own name, Tom. I certainly don't call myself Tom. So that's the vowel. It can be kind of difficult to pinpoint a vowel that you don't use in your dialect, um, but now that you have heard it, you will probably start to recognize it in a lot of um, dialects, especially in TV and movies. Hope this helps.